Being a Twitch streamer, it's not cheap, and therefore, it's gonna require you out there, if you wanna have a streaming career or streaming adventures, you're gonna have to start making an income. And in this video right here, I'm gonna show you how to make $100 per month on Twitch's platform. Let's go. Hey, it's me, it's Wild coming at you for my stream support playlist. And if this is your first time here and you wanna learn how to grow and improve your stream, make sure you hit that big red subscribe button and tick that bell so you know when my videos go live for you. And hey, at any point in this video, if you like the products or the services that I'm talking about, did you all a favor, put links in the show notes below so make sure you check them out. Let's be clear really quick. It is okay for any streamer out there to earn an income or revenue off any streaming platform, especially Twitch. A lot of costs goes into having a streaming career that people just don't understand. And it's okay if you out there wanna earn some revenue so that way you can continue to generate content for your viewers, your regulars, your subscribers, and everyone beyond in your community. So now that we got that taken care of, let me show you how you can make $100 a month on Twitch. So all this awesome information I'm about to lay down on you is for Twitch affiliates and above. So if you're not a Twitch affiliate yet, take a look at this video first. It's how to become a Twitch affiliate fast because that'll help you get to these steps that are gonna help you out coming up. And if you're a Twitch partner, hey, these steps will still help you out too because I know a lot of Twitch partners that still don't make $100 per month. Twitch cheer bits and Twitch subscriptions are gonna be our two main sources for you to earn an income on Twitch. And my whole goal for you is to make sure that you get 50 USD and 50 USD in these two categories. And with the tips that I'm about to give you, I'm going to show you how that's possible to earn $100 per month on Twitch, which is going to get you roughly around $1,200 for the year, which is going to be awesome if you're a streamer out there, because that's going to help a lot with your streaming gear and games. Let's start off with our Twitch cheer bit category. What if I told you there was a way to earn 500% more bits. What if I told you there was a way to earn a thousand percent more bits per stream? Kind of would blow your mind, right? Well, I'm about to. There's an easy trick that you can do. Most streamers don't realize when you become a Twitch affiliate, when you receive bits, there's a minimum requirement to send bits. And as default, Twitch sets that to one cheer bit. But you have the capability of going into your settings and changing this minimum. You can change it to five cheer bits, which would be 500% more per donation sent to you. Or you can change this to 10, which would be a thousand percent more cheer bits sent to you per donation. And this is a powerful tip because this is a tip that will help get you to that 50,000, which is 50 USD, very quickly. It's just as easy for someone to send you five bits versus one bit or 10 bits versus one bit. They're pretty close to the same number, but they have percentage wise a huge impact within that 30 days. Now, there is a sweet spot. Take into consideration where that sweet spot is for you, because if you go from one to 20 or one to 50 or one to 100, it makes it very tough for people to donate. But there's not that big of a difference because it's only a few pennies at the lower end numbers and people are willing to stack those and they make a huge, huge impact. Our next tip comes down to something that you're probably all really familiar with, but we're gonna refine it. Having a bit donation goal. What we want to do here to make this effective is you wanna make a bit donation goal per month and you wanna set it to that 50,000 bits donation goal amount, which equates to 50 USD. Now, a lot of you out there are probably thinking, well, I already have a donation goal and nobody really donates to me. That's because you're doing it wrong. You're doing it wrong. There's an effective way to have donation tickers and goals. And I'm gonna give you a really cool tip here that's gonna help you out, but we can get more in depth. If you guys would like a video on how to get like more bits, more subs, more support, how to use donation tickers correctly, let me know in the comments below. But the quick tip that I'm gonna give you right here is you need to have incentives for when people donate in that thermometer or that barometer or that ticker or whatever that bar, whatever you wanna call it is, you need to have an incentive for when it's reached. And a lot of cool things can be done for this. You can do some gifting, some subs, or you can do a community night, or you can play a particular game, or you can do a dress up stream. There are a lot of options. People like seeing you achieve milestones and goals. So let people know what you're trying to earn within that time frame, And that way, if you hit it, you're gonna give them an incentive and a reward. This helps out a lot. I bet you guys didn't know there's a way to earn more bits weekly on your stream. A really cool trick to do is if you go into your dashboards and you go to your affiliate settings and you go to the top cheer section, which is at the bottom of that page there, if you change that setting to weekly, 
you're gonna get people that are gonna donate more often in a given week. And there's a really cool scientific fact behind this. People like seeing their name. And if you enable top cheers, their name's gonna be displayed in the top three sections there. Now, the cool thing about this is the names will keep rotating every week. So everybody will get to see generally new names at the top of the board and everybody likes seeing their name. If people do like monthly or all time, you generally see the same three names, which means people aren't as encouraged to donate five, 10, 15 bits at a time because there's people that have given hundreds. So change this to weekly and you'll see how many more bits you get per week because those names at the top keep cycling. Now that we got bits all taken care of, let's concentrate on subscribers. My goal for you is to get about 20 subscribers per month and this will get us to the 50 USD mark as well. And to get more subs, we have to concentrate on a few things. And the easiest thing to do is have your tier one emote be awesome. Have it be stellar but more importantly, have it be unique and have it be different from everybody else's channel out there. One of the biggest problems I personally see on all new Twitch affiliates is they all have generally the same type of emote. They have an, a hello, they have a buy, they have a lurk, they have a hype, they have a love. You know what? So do everybody else out there. You're not making yourself that different. Now it's fine to have those particular types of emotes and emote categories. Just refine them down so yours is special. The reason you wanna do this is because people will hold on to the unique or the different that is on Twitch, which is gonna help with your subscriber retention. Our next tip for subscribers is make it easy for people to see what kind of rewards or perks they're gonna get for being a subscriber. Don't be afraid to have a panel that literally states out, this is what you get within my channel when you subscribe. It makes it very easy and it actually helps people clarify what they're gonna get out of your channel. Having clarity is key. Now, if you need help with what kind of subscriber perks you should have, I've already done a video on that. Make sure you pause this video right here or wait till the end, but I will put a card at the top that gives you a bunch of good ideas that I recommend you taking a look at and pick and choose which ones work best for you. Our next tip for subs is the same tip that we gave for bits. You wanna have a goal. You wanna have a ticker that displays how many subs you're trying to get within that given month and set it for the month. We're trying to get 20, so make sure you set it 220 and you want to do the same thing like we said for bits you want to offer rewards and incentives and this is what's going to make people reach into their pocket and help support the content that you're generating on your channel think about when you hit the goal how you're going to reward or incentivize these particular community members you can do special streams you can do sub only nights you can do gamer nights there are a ton of different rewards that you can give and a lot of people love helping support but make sure you give a little support back to them within the content that you generate on your channel the next tip i have is a little controversial and to be honest it's kind of a pet peeve of mine but it works so i want to bring it to your attention there is a really cool twitch extension out there that notifies new viewers to your channel if they have an unused Twitch Prime membership that they can use it on your channel. This extension is called Prime Subscription and Loot Reminder. And all you need to do is go into your panels and activate this extension and add it to your stream. And this way, every time a new person that has a free Prime membership can use it on your channel and you'll be surprised at how much this pays off. Now, the reason I kind of don't like it as much because it adds something on screen that kind of blocks the content, but again, it's my own personal opinion. So you decide if you think it's gonna be the best fit for you. A lot of Twitch affiliates and partners don't even realize that viewers to their channel can have the ability to subscribe to their channel through a mobile device. And a lot of people don't grant access to this view to this user base and it's really easy to do twitch actually gives you designated links which i'll put in the show notes below so make sure you check them out just put your username in where the blank is and all you need to do is add this to your panel if you take a look at my friend paint with jade stream she does this perfectly as you scroll through your mobile device there you're able to tap on the graphic which will take you to a link that allows you to subscribe to this channel and boom all these viewers that are on mobile devices now have the opportunity to support your channel. This is one of the biggest tips I can give you out there. Now, if you're a real creative person out there, you can do something very unique with your bits and your subs. Depending on what alert or widget service that you use out there, you can add variations set at different amounts. For a tier one, tier two, or tier three sub, you can have different alerts pop up on variations, which make things very interesting. You can do the same thing with bits at different amounts. Maybe it's 100 bits or 1,000 bits or 10,000 bits. Whatever numbers you wanna classify out there, you can have something different happen in your stream when these processes happen. And the trick to these are, 
are make something unique and fun that's really exhilarating to see on stream. Because the trick that I want to pull off to you all out there is if you can entice people to donate at these higher numbers because they see something unique on stream that they've never seen before, whether it be funny or entertaining or charismatic or just generally creative that nothing's been done, you will see donation trains happen. And this happens more than you know. Look, streaming isn't easy and it's definitely not cheap, which is why all these tips are going to help refine you down to make a bigger impact so you can help support your streaming career and streaming adventure. And if you guys like this type of video, I've done another video on how to make even more money without being a partner on Twitch. I'll put it in the top of the card here, so make sure you check that out and make sure to share it all because I want you guys to be bigger and better at your streaming careers and adventures. And money, sadly, it's gonna help you get you there. If you guys like this type of video and you want me to do more videos on how to generate you more money or how to make you have a bigger impact on streaming platforms, you know what to do. Leave me a comment below and let me know how I can help you and I will see what I can do to make a video on it. If you'd like to help me, don't be afraid to follow me on over on my Twitter and my Instagram. And if you like what you see here, you'll definitely like what you see over at my Twitch account. Go to twitch.tv slash wild for games. And if you like what you do see there, you can help support me by hitting that almighty subscribe button. Thank you to those that already have. I will see you all in my next stream support video coming up real soon. Take care all, peace.